Today, a sweeping public service ad campaign got underway to educate us all about COVID vaccines. It's called It's Up to You. Our senior health correspondent, Monica Robbins, shows us what we can expect. Medical professionals have been trying for months to engage and educate Ohioans about the COVID vaccine, like this message from the Ohio Department of Health. It's the best way to protect our health. But still, 40% of the country is on the fence about whether to get it when it's their turn. And research shows only 60% of Americans feel they have enough info to guide their decision. But in communities of color, that confidence drops to 40%. Enter the Ad Council and a new campaign. <laughs> It's designed to make sure that people have credible, validated information so that they can make, um, you know, the right decision for themselves. It's called It's Up to You because it is your choice to get educated and vaccinated. But they're also providing a website in seven languages that can help dispel myths and answer your questions. Getting as many people vaccinated as possible is the best way that we have, along with masking, social distancing, uh, and washing hands to get past this pandemic and back to the things and the people that we miss so much. Joining the effort are major retailers, media, faith leaders, and trusted messengers such as the CDC, and the American Medical Association is behind it as well. Its president, Dr. Bailey, is an allergist and knows many have questions about the risk of reactions. We are seeing a true allergic reactions to the vaccine in about four or five patients out of a million. So the, the allergic reactions are very rare and they've all been treatable. So the ad industry says this is one of the largest public education efforts in U.S. history, with advertisements running on television, radio, websites, and social media. And the website, Russ, is called vaccine, GetVaccineAnswers.org. And, of course, I put it in our vaccine section on WKYC.com so you can check it out. It is vetted. It is validated. And I know I'm probably going to be using it to help answer some of the questions that I get as well, Russ. Monica approved. All right, Monica Robbins, thank you. <laughs>